Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Joni Young and today I'm gonna to show you step-by-step -step for beginners how to paint this camping scene. Okay, so we wanna create a nice warm sunset, like golden yellow, golden tones. So I'm gonna start with my flat brush here. I'm gonna take some white and some warm yellow and I'm just gonna start spreading that across the top. We're gonna to have our sun right about here. Let's just add a little circle right about here. I'm gonna add more white and some water. And I'm just gonna catch the bottom of it. And start pulling in with a little bit more of the orange now, creating some. Okay, I'm gonna take a tiny bit of pink, a little bit of white, and a little bit of blue. I'm just gonna take a little bit more white soften that tone up. So now we've got this beautiful shade of lavender and we're just going to hold our brush kind of flat like this and go around in flat little bumps and circles inside some of those peach at the top here. And just use the corner of your brush to make all sorts of edges and bumps. And then we're going to come right down sort of have that sun cradled in between the mountain range. Then I'm gonna come way up top here and I'm just gonna start making patchy marks so that you create a lot of different peaks. To our mountains. Okay, I'm going to come in with a little bit more black and blue now. Just to show you how much I have on my brush. And just start turning, wiggling, dragging the brush this way and that way. Don't have to think too much about it. I pick up a little bit of white and we'll start adding Some lighter tones now. Some more white right about here. This is when I'm gonna use my dry mop brush. I'm just gonna soften, soften, soften. I'm gonna do the same thing Right here, apply a little bit of white over the base here and just mist, mist that up. Add a little bit more. And we're gonna just come down from both sides, we're gonna come in front of this one now. Right off the right side. We're gonna come down, drop it down a little lower. And then we're gonna pull around like this. Take some water.
And I'm gonna turn my brush like this and I'm gonna tap up and down to add some trees. It could look like this mountain's a little bit closer to us. We can't see all the details on the trees, but we can see some Add a little bit of water when you need to. And we'll have this one just set back a little farther. Let's take some blue. I'm going to take some blue and white. Less white to filter over these mountains. I'm going to bring down a little bit in here. Very delicate. And then I'm going to take the rest and start adding it in the water. Take a little bit of water on my brush. Some white and yellow. A little bit of pink and orange in there. Now what I want to do is take some blue and some pink and I'm going to bring some little ripples closer in here, partially over those light colors that we just added. and accept that soft gold shade again. More white than yellow. That section, I'm going to pull it out and across here and kind of loop down and then slightly bring it back up. I'm going to paint this in. In here. So I'm just going to pull a line down like that, little branches, and then leave some spaces too, and then just start to make them bigger or come out a little wider.
And I'm going to add a small triangle. Slide it. Our walls here for stuff inside the tent. And I'm going to scoop down again. Another little diagonal one and then a scoop, just like you're painting a house. A bit of white on the top there. The sun reflecting off some rocks. I'm going to add a little misshapen. some black at the base, and then we're going to make this fire circle of stars. Look at that. Wick, wiggle up gentle little flames. And then I'll take some orange, and I'm going to come right down here on this, on the top of that rock. partially over the yellow and then just a little bit on the outside as well blue and white and I'm gonna come come down here bring it up and let off so it makes it just a little narrower on the top. I'm going to use my filter brush again. Colors. I'm just going to choose a few areas. I'll take a little bit more of my greens. Just to add a hint of that on. And if we take a little bit of the warm yellow. Mix that in. Make another shade of green. A little bit more orange and white. Yellow and white.
We'll just catch some of the branches and trees down here. Okay, this painting's all done. I want to thank you guys so much for joining me today. I'll see you all very soon in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye!